Hey spiritual superstars, we are going to do a, a quick reading for our full moon and Aries energy because it is blasting away some skeletons and it is blasting away some fears and I want to make sure we're all good, okay? So take a beautiful deep breath in and raise your vibration. Come on now, deep, deep, deep. We are being asked to do the work this week and release. Push that all away from you. Thank you so much, Divine Source. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. The laziness, the behaviors that we feel like we should have or we should do, we need to do to please other people, all that, we're shaking it off, we're letting it go. The fear of our own success, we're letting it go. With this Aries full moon energy, Spirit is blessing us to be the warrior inside and out and to wear that armor and to be protected against the enemies of self. And to just be okay with who we really are. And to be okay with who spirit wants us to be. Detach from self. Thank you so much. Detach from self. Whether that is being too ego driven or whether that is being too emotional. Whether that is just refusing to... Do life the way that we are meant to do it. I feel like this is such a shake-up. And it's such a passionate, fiery uh, energy that it's, it's just very intense. And we just need to acknowledge that. Aries full moon energy and so remember to bring love back into the equation because we need that balance okay we need to remember that even though we're being asked to make these adjustments other people are too and when we come out on the other side we'll be okay with showing everybody who we truly are because we will have looked at our shadow self and said, you know what? Hey, how are you? I love you and I'm not going to judge you because you are me and I am you. And so when you feel this energy of being turned inside out, when you feel that eruption of that intensity coming out, honey, it's only because... The things that have been submerged deep inside have got to surface. You know when the iceberg is floating in the ocean, what we don't see is the major currents that are swirling around it. I mean, the currents are all around. They're going in all different directions. And if any droplet of anything comes in, it pulls it straight down. There's so much activity and movement underneath that placid surface, but it's still a mirror reflection nonetheless. It's still a mirror. And so remember that the struggle is truly because we are being forced to look at our shadow self right now. And we can get through this. Thank you so much. This is a celebration. This is really an awakening. This is a moment of truth. Remember, you are the pioneer. You have the right to create with this Aries beautiful pioneering energy. And the sky isn't even the limit. What is it that you want? What is it that you don't want? You no longer have to... Woo! Go by what spirit is telling you, or not what spirit, you don't have to go by what society is telling you 
to do. You don't have to ignore the truth that is within you anymore. This full moon energy says release it. Let it go. Be okay with being who you are. Being true to you. You have the right to create. You have the right to make your dreams come true. You have the right to just go full speed ahead and own your power now. What is it that you want? Focus on it. That is what will expand. Let the emotions come, but seek the peace that you need. Avoid the drama and rechannel the intensity from you and other people the best way you can. None of us are perfect. That's why you're going to make those adjustments. Okay? And that's why you're going to love on other people and you're going to acquiesce and placate in a healthy way. Not all the time. But when the situation calls for it, you're going to walk away. And you're going to maintain your peace. Not every situation is yours. Not every battle is yours. And not every situation needs you to say anything. Right? Some things you just, you don't need to say. It may be right. You may be right. But sometimes... Your strategy is going to be, I, mom's the word, I'm not saying a word. I'm not saying anything. I'm going to show up in my higher self. And I'm going to use this energy for good. And I'm going to step into who I am becoming. Because I am no longer who I was. And I get to detach and release and let go and let God. Because this is the full moon in Aries energy that says, I am reborn. I have been through the fire. And I can expect a rebirth. Well, all right, dear loves. If there's anything that I can do for you, I'm here. We have new reading specials. Um, they are, let me get this right. They are $45 for a 30-minute reading. And they are $75 for a 60-minute reading. And they all come with a keepsake video and I will be as detailed as spirit lets me and this is just an example of what you receive except it will be extremely detailed and specific for you and uh, may God continue to bless you and your family and help your dreams come true remember this you absolutely can make your dreams come true they are your dreams. Honor them. All right, dear loves. Take great, great care. Oh, I hear something else coming. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Please show me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I keep hearing, remember your power. Okay, remember your power. All is not lost. You might be feeling the storm, but remember your power. Okay, remember that this is all for a reason. Pull back. Okay, pull back when you feel like it's getting a lot too fiery. It's getting, it's getting a little bit too hot. But don't pull back when you know your blessing is in 
that outer side of self being burned away. Pull back when the attack is coming from another human being because that ego is what is prompting that energy to, to really turn. And you can't control that. You can control yourself by taking yourself out of the equation. It's that energy that is dense matter. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Don't let that energy destroy your happiness is what I'm hearing. This is a time for you to do things differently. Thank you so much. And just honor your power. Let people see the God in you. Let, let people see the Holy Spirit inside of you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. There you go. Let people see the Holy Spirit in you. You must feed faith and starve fear. All right? There's a shift happening. Remember your power. All right, dear loves. I look forward to speaking with you and reading for you very soon. Love you.